Hello Explorers, this is Julio from Julio's Photo Trip and I want to talk about some easy hikes and easy cheap trips you can take to begin your journey because you, you're probably wondering like where, where should I start or what should I look into you know, you, you probably don't want to spend a lot of money traveling, you know, nobody does, but that's what I'm here for. I'm here to give you some recommendations and I'm, I want to talk about some cheap hikes and places you can go to that are really cool, in my opinion. And so the first place I want to talk about, we can talk about the state of Arizona because the state of Arizona is super beautiful. One of the most beautiful states I've been to with beautiful sunsets, the parks, are beautiful it's just you know everything is beautiful and if you go into Arizona I would recommend going to Phoenix you know Phoenix is the the capital there's a lot of stuff to do it's, there's a lot of parks to go to that are not far from the city and there's a lot of hikes you can do that are not far from the city and they don't even cost any money so that's what we're looking for and one of the parks that I recommend going is Papago Park and Arizona which is just a few minutes from downtown um you can just drive up to it park and it's like right when you get out of your car there's a a beautiful little pond there there's a, a little height you can go go to that overlooks the city and the, you can see the planes flying into the city, and you can just, I went there to watch the sunset, and it was beautiful. You know, it's one of the most beautiful parks I've been to. There's trails. Um, you know, the hike is also not hard at all. It takes just a few minutes to walk up there, and, and it, depending on the time of day, um, you could probably go where there's no, there's no people, there's not a lot of traffic, so, yeah, that's one of the parks I recommend going. And if you really want a little challenge, you know, a little hike challenge, I would recommend driving about an hour and a half to two hours north of Phoenix to Sedona, Arizona, which is very popular. Um, place to go hike. There's a lot of trails. There's a lot of hiking spots. There's a lot of views. Um, one of the trails that I've did, that I've done, is the Devil's Bridge Trail, which is uh, also a popular trail. The Devil's Bridge is uh, it's kind of like a natural bridge looking um rock that people go to you can go to that go to the edge and you know there's a it's a very nice view there's also another trail the oak creek canyon which you can there's a the the river that um that flows uh, near the trail and you can walk by the river the whole time and you can see the rock formations and it's just, it's a great time. There's also the Broken Arrow Trail, which is also popular. And the West, the West Creek, the West Fork Oak Creek Trail, which is another one of my favorites, um, which follows the creek or the river down this valley and you know you're you're down in the valley and you're just going uh following the creek and it's it's super beautiful another spot that i recommend going which is a very popular de destination to most americans is the grand canyon and the grand canyon is about an hour north of Sedona, so everything is within like three, three and a half hours of Phoenix. So if you fly into Phoenix, you know, three, three and a half hours of driving will get you all these trails and hikes. 
and they don't even cost a lot of money so and the Grand Canyon is you know located north uh, the north part of Arizona and there's a lot of things you can do at the Grand Canyon you can there's a lot of trails you don't even really need to hike the Grand Canyon to see how beautiful it is you can drive into it uh, the parking spots are pretty close to where the Grand Canyon begins so and this the Grand Canyon does cost a little bit of money but it's not bad it's not something you could you would want to pass up because you know you don't really have to challenge yourself to go see how beautiful it is but there is some hikes that that you can challenge yourself and are really really beautiful that lead to really beautiful views and you know the the whole state of Arizona is just f full of hikes and views so anywhere you go in Arizona would lead you to something you can do and a pl place that you can go explore according to the official Grand Canyon website you know you can camp right outside of the Grand Canyon you, there's a lot of camping spots that you can just drive in and set up your tent there's uh maps and broach brochures that help with giving you tips and stuff for hiking and it gives information about the the bright angel trail the the khabib forest which is right outside of the grand canyon it's a good time i had a, a, a lot of fun times to my trip to arizona and i would recommend everybody to check out the state of arizona uh thank you for joining me on today's journey and this is Julio, and I'll see you guys next time.